Hello friends, welcome to Life in Envelopes. I am Jennifer Bleacher. It is a brand new month, which means it is time to set up our budget. I'm gonna to start today by laying down all of these beautiful um, decorative budget stickers. This pattern is Wildflowers and it's from my Etsy shop, Life in Envelopes. I do have a link to my Etsy shop in the description box below, as well as a discount code for all of my YouTube viewers. So if you like this or like to see what else I offer, make sure you check that out. Okay, I am going to play some music for you as I get this all set up, but before we get to that, I did want to give a big, huge shout out to all of my new patrons. Thank you, friends, so much. I am going to uh, share their names with you at the end of the video in the closing credits, but we just appreciate you guys so much, and I just wanted to give a verbal thank you as well. So in today's video, in addition to setting up all these beautiful stickers, we are also going to set up the monthly budget, the week one budget, and then we're going to do a cash envelope stuffing. I'm not answering any questions in this video. I will be doing a Q&A section in my next budget check-in video, which will be coming out on Sunday or Monday next week. So if you asked a question in my last video, your answer will be coming very soon. Okay, friends, let's listen to some music. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubt Be free with me Be free Be free with me Okay, now that I have everything set up, let's do a quick walkthrough. So here is my monthly spread with my budget category um, key on the side here. Then I have my monthly budget for all of our fixed expenses, which we're going to fill in together in just a moment. Next is my dashboard where I track my current debts, my debt update, my income comparison from last month to this month, and I, I um, calculate the percent of my income to all the budget categories for the month. Then we move on to weekly spreads. I do one expense tracker per week and then one weekly budget for our variable expenses, which is covered by my income. I'm paid once a week. So there are four of those this month. Okay, so let's move on to the monthly budget and get that set up. So the monthly budget is covered by my husband's paycheck. My husband is David. He is paid once a month and it is a fixed amount. So we use that to cover most of our fixed expenses. Okay, so our fixed expenses are our mortgage, which is $13.35, State Farm, which is $132, Netflix, which will be $17, Metronet, which is $99. That is our internet service. Google Fi, which is $91. That's cell phone service for three cell phones. HBO, which is 18. Ames. This is our city, and we pay them for water and electricity, and that's going to be $291. SUV, 118. And Alliant Energy, um, we're going to set aside $27 for that. Okay, so let's see all together how much that's going to be. Okay, all together that's going to be $21.28, which is all of David's paycheck. So if everything goes as planned, we should end the month at zero. Okay, let's move on to the week one budget. So this month is unusual where we're actually starting with a negative balance from last month. So we're going to start with that first. We have a negative rollover of $34 from last month. And then we're going to do um, my first paycheck. So most of my income comes from Etsy and YouTube. I'm paid once a week. We're paid out of my business account and it varies. Uh, my goal is 528, but sometimes it's a little bit less. Sometimes you can put a little bit more, but usually I try to pay myself 528. Today I'm going to pay myself 562. So 562 minus 34 means we are going to have 528 to work with this week. 
It's a good week for us. I'm excited. It's been a while. So I'm going to start with the sinking funds. Okay, so this is for our annual membership. We are going to set aside $3 for that. Car maintenance will get $10. Car registration will get $5. Christmas will get $20. Sam's Club, um, this is for our annual membership, will get $3. Vacation will get $30. And Vet will get $5. So let's see how much that's going to be all together. So all together that is $76. So 528 minus 76, that is 452. So we have 452 left to work with. Let's move up to our fixed expenses. So while David's paycheck covers most of our fixed expenses, there's a few that aren't covered, so we cover those with my paycheck. And we put a little bit aside each week in cash envelopes to cover that. Well, actually, first, the first one just comes out of the bank automatically. Loan number two, that's going to get 142. So this is a debt consolidation loan. It comes out of our bank account every week automatically. So that's the first thing we pay. And then we set aside money for garbage and Alliant Energy. Alliant Energy is the um, gas for our house. So we set aside $5 for garbage and $10 for Alliant Energy. So altogether, that's going to be 157. So 452 minus 157 is 295. Let me just double check my math to make sure that's right. Yes, that's right. Then moving on to variables. So we have food, gas, miscellaneous, and spending. So food will get $200, gas will get 20, Miscellaneous will get 25 and spending will get 50. That is 10 for Logan, 20 for me, and 20 for David. So all together, that is $295, if I did everything right, which means that we are going to budget out at zero this week. Let me just double check and make sure that equals 295. Yes, okay, perfect. Let's get to the cash envelopes. Okay, so for cash envelopes today, we're gonna to stuff $171. So let's start by counting our money, make sure we have the correct amount. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71. So we have the perfect amount. By the way, friends, this um, nail polish is from London Town, and I am a London Town affiliate. The color is, is, I think it's Duchess. Yeah, this is Duchess. And I do have a link to London Town, an affiliate link down in the description box below if you wanna check them out. Okay, so let's start with our bills. So there's two bills that we save for. First is garbage. And today we are setting aside $5 for garbage, so now we have $15 saved for garbage. We're trying to save up $60 for that. Next is Alliant Energy, and today we're going to add another $10. We're trying to get up to $40, so we have $30, so we have one more week to go there. Moving on to our variable expenses. Starting with my spending money, I'm going to get $20. Logan is going to get 10, David is going to get 20, gas will get 20, and miscellaneous will get 25. Okay, and the last one we're gonna stop is the sinking funds. Starting with our Amazon. So today we're going to add three dollars, one, two, three. So let's see how much we have saved all together. This is for our annual membership. We have 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. So we have $42 saved for that. Next is back to school. We're actually gonna skip back to school and birthdays for right now. Car maintenance. Car maintenance is going to get $10. So we have 100, 120, 140, 150, 160, 165. Okay, car registration. We recently paid this. That's why we are only 
have five dollars, we're gonna add another five today, so now we have ten. Christmas is going to get twenty dollars. And I just want to give a shout out to one of my viewers. She sent me these beautiful $100 placeholders. I actually um, put the, when, I ha when I'm able to make $100, I try to keep that in my savings account. That way I don't have so much cash on hand. So I want to give a big thank you to Aisha Fraction. She, does, she said that she doesn't have an Etsy shop yet, or she does, but she doesn't have product. So I told her if she ever does have product, let us know because I would love to um, support her. Okay, so one, two, three. So we have 330. Today we're going to add another 20. So now we have $350. Okay, so next is Sam's Club. And Sam's Club is going to get $3 today. So let's see how much we have saved up for Sam's. We have 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. So we have $42 saved up there. For vacation, we're going to add $30. And vet, we're going to add five. I only have 20, so I'm $15 short. I made a mistake somewhere. Let me make a note. <laughs> okay, so vacation needs 10. 10 more, and vet needs five more. So I don't know where I made the mistake. I will always, I'll probably catch it when I'm, when I'm editing the video, but at this point, I don't know where I made the mistake. Somewhere I put $15 where I shouldn't have, or maybe I didn't withdraw enough from the bank. Who knows? I'll figure it out. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, will you please give it a thumbs up, and I will see you all again next time. Bye, everyone. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. What we can be, life with no distractions. We'll get away. This is what we waited for